So what's up, so I'm fine back though today. Got a really, 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 really quick um, Beyblade video. I'm gonna do that really quick. I'm gonna right into right into the video. There's so much good stuff to talk about. We got lots of images, anime teasers, not anime teasers, but images and stuff like that, of course, for the um, yeah, um for a variant loose first, but that a really cool looking bay, really does the kind of name bay and stuff like that, of course. I'm gonna go over everything really quick though for it. Um, we got some again new images and stuff like that, of course, for the um, Beyblade. It is um, it just released July 18th and stuff like that. Of course, we got new info, new um stuff like that, of course, for it. So yeah, I'll try to upload this video and the um stuff like that, kind of get official, because you know I don't want to upload like I mean I do upload loop videos, but I just don't want to you know go you know just want to just go right into it though, of course. But yeah, of course, this is um Lang Uranus, of course. Uh, I don't think it has like a I think it has a bottom and a top though for it, a performance saving driver for it. Um, we haven't seen I mean chassis stuff like that, of course, but this is Lang's first. Bang from um, you know, Lane Bahala and stuff like that, of course. Um, we all know that's how he is. Um, that's how he was lived before. Of course, we have, um, I think it's first Uranus or you know, um, uh, yeah, you know, or Uranus and stuff like that, of course. Um, that's been kind of popping around the internet, you know, a few weeks, you know, it's like, kind of like Hyperion and Valtteri kind of came together. Um, we already seen Variant this first. This is Lane's first bay, though, of course. Um, but yeah, um, again, we already just, you know, seen that and stuff like that for it, um, for the bay and stuff like that. But yeah, um, hopefully, you know, we'll, you know, um, game, a game right for when it comes out and stuff like that, of course. But yeah, um, also, also we got some new Hasbro stadiums and stuff like that. Um, one from the Toy Fair, which I think happened a few, not too long ago, like a few months ago. I mean, I made a bit of video because the Toy Fair came out for that stuff, like, you know, Quad Smack, um, Overtale. I had a video recorded, I've not edited it yet, so yeah, I need to get on that. I need, like, I have a whole day where I just need to edit a whole bunch of videos. Of course, this is Lane himself, Lane Valhalla. Um, we already seen teasers like, you know, info and stuff like that, of course, because I'm doing teaser posters, all that stuff, of course, we should, um, get more info for him, though, because his design overall looks nice, looks great for him, um, fits him perfectly, stuff like that, you know, red boots, I mean, a burgundy or red, whichever you want to call it, has, um, of course, the, you know, fits for, you know, whether it's on launch launcher, or, you know, lots of Beyblade, of course, you know, dark blue, I can know, representing his bay overall, but yeah, you know, he's the main, I guess, protagonist for the, um, series, free to actually, um, no, because we also, um, if you guys just see the episode and stuff like that, I can know, I'm, I'm not gonna, like, say anything like that, but, um, or, I'm gonna be in the thumbnail image, though, but, of course, you know, um, I'm gonna even spoil everything real quick, so if you wanna cover your ears, go ahead, um, I'm gonna say, um, Free actually had, like, you know, he felt like, we battled, oh, I wanna say, Yuka, um, he actually had, like, a vision, not really a vision, but, you know, he's, she's all, um, you know, laying in his eyes, he, he said he reminded him of him, he's so, yeah, Yuka, the younger brother with the redhead, is not gonna be, you know, Lane as well, like everybody throughout and stuff like that. I think I personally I thought this could be that, you know, like maybe go to sleep, or you know, he'll call like mayhem or havoc, you know, after you know, all that little stuff like that, of course. But yeah, I do like the design, you know, very, very evil like. He's giving the main protagonist, of course. We have a 10 blade mode with um, Lucifer in the background, um, which is cool though, of course. Then right here, um, we have, of course, you know, variant Lucifer. Went over him tons of times in you know, some of the videos and stuff like that. Again, though, know, Hyperion, just getting you know, it kind of flux off, flux, fluxes off the main character with the, um, you know, dark purple. Again, I love the dark purple, light blue. Again, they're representing the character more and more and more as we like, you know, time goes on and stuff like that. Again, though, it looks nice, looks great and stuff like that, of course. Um, but yeah, again, I like the bay, I love the black, like, you know, black, light blue and purple. All matches really well. And of course, you know, the red and the like, burgundy in the background, of course, pink. Again, you know, all class colors mixed kind of together, and I did like it, though, of course. Um, but yeah, though, um, again, it looks nice, looks great. Again, though, they did, did a really good job for it. Again, I went over this 500 times. Again, though, it has a template mode with all the, like, the blades in the background represented more and more and more. So, yeah, like, all the, all the, like, the pink background. This is his base form right here. Hey, base form, Super Saiyan, I'm joking, though. But, um, that guy has, um, a... 10 blade mode right here. I think you know, 6 blade mode. I always got a 10 blade. I don't know why I call it 10 blade. It's just, I was gonna say, um, this is like regular, um, 6 blade mode, of course. You know, simple, simple, super stuff to grasp for it. Um, I know definitely this one is, um, you know, circle like form with, you know, powering up and stuff like that. Um, you know, using the blades and stuff like that. You know, it's a defensive show because it is a defensive type though. Um, but then right here, of course, Sparking Launcher um, is super black, purple, you know, following the similar um, color scheme and stuff like that for um, Lucifer. Typical stuff like that. Um, um, Sparking Launcher always kind of got, um, captures it. Of course, we have the full box art right here. I was thinking, like, oh yeah, new Achilles is back there. But I was like, oh, that's human you know, Achilles um, from Turbo, um, um, GT or, you know, Gachi or, you know, Rise, whichever one you want to call it. But yeah, um, again, though, um, super simple stuff for the box art. It looks nice, it looks great, I love it, it looks so beautiful for it. Uh, purple, black together perfectly. It was like blue and I'm like, oh yeah, but it's still good though overall. Um then of course right here, um we have the full details and breakdowns for it though of course. Um yeah this um, is its full um, you know grasp and stuff like that of course you know the art and stuff like that. Um again though we have the um, chip for it. Um again though, like a little bit like I appear around of course you know it falls up off the main character a lot. Um of course the driver I think it's not destroyed but I can't remember what it was. I think it's like 
And that one's very interesting or something like that. Can't remember, but of course we have the Gachi chip for it. I got you on um, chassis for it. Of course, the bottom looking big and bulky. You're like, oh, it's just for defensive types. Um, kind of like how you look kinetics or you know, um, Christ Satan or you know, Christ kinetics tune, whatever one you want to call it. You know, that's on my site tune, right? Can't even know. Um, but yeah, again, though, um, I think it's not that's really it though for it. It's full breakdown stuff like that. Of course, the um, you know, blade modes where it has um, where it's um. The blade mode where you know defending and stuff like that for it. Um again those simple stuff like that, but perhaps you know a big defensive type of course have like you know all the blades for it. Um which is good though of course for it and stuff like that. Um but yeah. That, that I think uh this is another Hasbro Stadium that I didn't really go over that much, but um of course we have um yeah that's um that's really it really it's loose for stuff again that's why I didn't really make it like you know um, cause that, that probably would've been the end of the video right there though, but, um, yeah. That's the new stuff for Hasbro. This same is pretty cool. This was shown about the Toy Fair, I think, 2020, and 2020, some 2019. A little before, I think, you know, before the world went crazy. Um, but yeah, um, of course we have the, um, Prime Apocalypse, and of course Judgment, Gold, um, uh, or no, just regular Judgment, um, Dragon, which is cool. Okay, I'm back, once more. Um, but I was gonna say, um, um, this is Sword, um, of course, um, Dragon, it looks nice. I love the color scheme, the black, silver, all of it looks nice, beautiful for it. Of course, I um, made you know, a super simple color scheme just to cover over change. It's, it's kind of like, you know, those booster packs, you know, those Hasbro exclusive and stuff like that. So, yeah, you know, it's typical, you know, Hasbro gimmick and stuff like that for, for it. Of course, um, ooh, excuse me, the air got some gas. Ooh. Um, but yeah, of course, we have another new color scheme. It's probably one more color schemes for Wizard, um, Luminor, or, you know, um, Longinus. Um, I, now I'm saying Luminor now. I'm um, saying Longinus now. But yeah, um, again, though, it has no rubber on it, so I can't absorb attacks. But it's still gonna do a lot of good damage. Being, you know, stamina is such a, you know, kind of blend of attack type. And of course, you know, um, Dragon's probably gonna be, um, Sword Dragon's gonna be more, you know, attack and stuff like that for it, though. For, um, it's kind of built kit. So, um, yeah. Those are the Beyblades for, um, you know, Walmart exclusive. We have, um, a few more Beyblades as well up as well. Um, we have Lewis Bryson, of course, you know, another Rocket Gorge, Sweet Color, simply. Yeah, we have Lewis Bryson available for Hasbro now, so I didn't go over this too much. It's only in a double pack. Um, we haven't seen, of course, of course you know, main Beyblades choose to come in more single or double packs, like they usually do. But, of course, um, you know, this is full color scheme designed for it. I still look nice, it looks great. Again, we can actually remove the chip and stuff like that. And, like, you know, the, um, Tech or Tommy version where it has, um, you know, um, the, you know, fused in chip and stuff like that. So, yeah. Um, probably for, like, the metal core and stuff like that for it. Um, but yeah, again, though, super simple for um, the color schemes. Of course, back, um, you know, shows box art, um, you know, typical stuff like that. It has, it's all fused together into one, like the Hasbro on um, the Attacker Tommy is. So it's good, though, of course. I think it has, like, the D69. I think that's from, um, Diablos or, you know, Diablos, whichever one you want to call it, though, again. But it has a fusion chip, like it always does. Um, it has a fusion um, energy layer, you know, balanced energy layer, like it usually does as well. Like, you know, um, super simple stuff from Rock to War, just a regular Rock to War. Like it is, I'm um, like Turbo, so you know, metal wings, you know, more, um, you know, um, raw, raw turbo, and I want to say, um, turbo slash chosy. So let's do, yeah, okay, I make, I had to make sure. So, yeah, um, I don't think on top of my head because I usually kind of know about this stuff. Like, you know, the Lord Sparks didn't have the rubber gimmick like usually does, so like impact attacks. Um, it's like, you know, Lunor and, no, yeah, Longinus and, um, um, I'm gonna say with um, Fafnir and of course Hasbro Fat, um, with the Fafnir and Hasbro on um, something, something I can't remember off the top of my head right now. Um, Judge Judgment Joker does have rubber on it, so it's you no know, full attacking. So yeah, again, the more of a balance of you know, it doesn't have rubber on it, it's just plastic for it. Um, again, though, has you know, it basically they got the code schemes right, exactly right, you know, no stickers and stuff like that. But it still looks nice, it still looks great for it, for design and stuff like that. But again, though, it still looks nice, it's good, good stuff. They did a good job for it, of course. Um, of course, you know, Rock the War, simple color scheme, they didn't change. I mean, just a simple one should color and stuff like that. They really too special for it. I just, you know, figured to go over it and stuff like that. You know, Rock the War really is not popular, though. I mean, you know, of course, you have the whole Battle Wing gimmick and stuff like that. But of course, you know, we got a Hyper Sphere Rock the War, so there you go. You want Rock the War? I don't think, I think that's, uh, I think Gachi's the only one, or GT, the only one that didn't do it. So, I, I actually had, like, a Rock the War. So, yeah. I mean, I guess the Gunner Ring fit or Red Jerk, because, you know, they're always the main, the main owner. See, so, you know, they didn't change them, or change them or anything like that. So, um, yeah. Then of course right here we have I want to say um um hi um Union Achilles again I always look over these guys in big batches and stuff like that so yeah we have Union Achilles though of course um it's called Union Achilles didn't change the name or anything like that I want to say it has like you know um you know the, the, the I think it has like um that I, that's that I can't remember I, like Achilles first performance set you know with Z Achilles uh so you want to just switch out the over from like you know Tech or Tommy or whatever you can do that um, Mongo has like the double sword game where you can take off the layer because with um Achilles. 
you can actually take off the layer and stuff like that. I actually have like, an image up here. Um, here. Um, but yeah, like I said, though, with the whole, you know, Bruce Willis like, sword gimmick, it takes off the blue pieces with great, you know, um, like the actual blue pieces right there. The sword is like little power slash Bruce Willis. And the dub, they actually did take that out though, completely. They didn't mention it at all in the dub. So it's like, oh, okay, kind of weird. They didn't mention that at all. So, okay. Um, but yeah, um, again, they'll probably super simple stuff like that. But yeah, again, though, I mean, just taking off the swords, that's just really it, though. But overall, still, still looks nice, still looks great. They still kept it well done. That, that I think this wasn't was kind of new with the whole you know, apocalypse sword um, thing. So it has, like, we actually got a new blue sword launcher with the gold, um, you know, scabbard piece. And then with the um, blue scabbard and you know, the whole golden sword. So yeah, we have another sword launcher available for Hasbro specifically. So you want to go ahead and buy that. It's a blue gold, you know, from apocalypse. So hey, um, you know, however, fuck the apocalypse. Like that type of thing, I don't know, because you know, the whole gimmick is the, the whole dark flux and everything, so that's kind of how it's you know, structured and everything like that. So that's kind of cool though for that. Of course, I think the last one right here is Heaven Pegasus, it doesn't have the burst up in gimmick, so um, that's all I'm gonna say right there. It has the whole you know, it's not the um, um, 10 you know, blade, you know, saw, you know, sword stuff like that. I'm sorry, 10 blade style, you know, um, energy, la energy layer. Um, oh my gosh, it's an energy layer. I, I keep forgetting. Um, energy, wait, oh my gosh. Like I said, 10 disc, 10 disc. I really said that though, but it doesn't have the whole beautiful you know, performance ever, you know, kind of, um, you know, this, you know, put the performance ever, stuff like that. So yeah, the Super Bowl Heaven Pegasus, and this is the full design for it, stuff like that, of course. But, yeah, um, it does have rest off just to support, you know, Heaven Pegasus stuff, like it usually is. But it actually did do a good job. If you compare this to the um, Hasbro, version, Hasbro version, um, and this, no, this to the Japanese version, Takara Tommy, still good though. But yeah, it's all we want to go today again though. We got some good moves for stuff, of course, you know, for learning and stuff like that. Um, Again, though, super simple stuff to grasp. Um, grasp. But yeah, gonna go ahead and end the video here, though. So, yeah. So, you guys are though. Thanks for watching. Have a great day. Great life. All the good junk. Again, though, we got links for details and stuff like that for the bank, for designs, you know, real estate, which we already knew about that. Um, full new base, stuff like that for Hasbro. Um, so, yeah, what do you guys think, though? Of course. So, yeah, see you guys are though. Again, though. So.